Hello everyone. Today we are going to see how we can add a reference image to 3D Max 2020. Using materials to add a reference image could be a tedious process. Thanks to 3D Max 2020 and some older versions this process is as easy as saying I am Iron Man. So let's begin. We would be needing an image to start with. And its dimensions. I have already downloaded the file so I won't be downloading it again. You can download the image and measurement from the description below. After having all our files downloaded. Open Photoshop. Click on new file and add the values mentioned on the site. Select centimeters from the drop down menu. And you can also change the resolution of the image. This file will later be used as our reference image. Now open the file which we downloaded to Photoshop and drag and drop it onto the newly created file. Adjust the image. Note, the downloaded image should fill up most of the area of the file which we created. Don't distort the image. Scaling the image till the border of the file would be fine. As it would help us achieve real world scale measurements. Once you are satisfied with the scaling go ahead and export the image, to your desired location. Now open 3D Max and create a new file. Press T. For top viewport. After that select the plane tool and create a plane. Add the values given on the side to the plane. This is an important process so please don't skip it or else the image may not appear properly. Press P. For perspective viewport, press Z to zoom the object. Now open the folder where we exported our Photoshop JPG. Drag and drop the JPG file over the plane. As you can see the object image can be seen on the plane but it's still not proper. So let's fix it. Click on the modifier panel and uncheck the real world map size. Now we can see the image properly projected on the plane. Now we can freeze the plane and start modeling. Please let me know what else I can help you with and subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the bell icon. Until next time.